Hey guys, Mitch here. I want to do a try to make a quick video of my Acaso V50X that I ordered and it came in yesterday. Action camera. Well, I'm having a problem. Um, I did some recordings here in the in, in the house in my room, and when I bring the video in here, right now the video I can play it in VLC, right? Plays fine, but when I bring it in DaVinci Resolve, it doesn't see the audio track. Is it? I mean, the audio track's there, but there is no data. The video works fine. I'm satisfied with the video quality, and that was for being in, you know, in, indoors. I was gonna, I was going to do some video outside today, but it's raining. But um, it will not show up any audio data, right? Now you could say I have some settings wrong, but let me show you. Let me show you what's going on. Here. Okay, I have two files up here. I got a two files from the Acaso V50X. There's one there, two, three, one here. And there's no waveform shown, right? And I'm gonna hit play. Nothing there, right? Let me, let me scrub through this. With my beautiful doll there, right? Let me go through, let's go to the second file here. Nothing there, right? Nothing there, nothing, honey. Hi, Skylar. Okay. I have two other files on here. One for my Zoom camera, the Q2M 4K. Look, immediately you can see the waveform right there. Let me put this other one in here too. This this one I did on the, uh, I recorded in OBS. All right. So let's go up, let's go up to that, the Zoom camera one. Hit play. Hi, Mitch here again. Just doing what do you know? There's sound. My audio is any better? And if I'm make, uh, let's go to the one I recorded with OBS. What do you know? There's sound there too. Okay, I'm not sure what the problem was because, like I said, I I can play. You know, when I bring the audio from the Acosta to the computer via USB uh, cable that does power and data, you know, it's important. Some people are having problems. I think the cable they sent me only does power. So there's what, what uh, that Acosta sent me didn't even work. But I have plenty of good cables, right? And uh, and it plays, it will, the audio files from the Acosta, Acosta will play on Shotcut which is an, another free video editor. This is DaVinci Resolve. I like using DaVinci Resolve. I, everybody knows about this, you know, how, how good this is, right? But you have to, you have to study, you, know, you have to learn to program. But anyway, so why does it work in Shotcut and not, not in here? So you see all your fi files fine in, in uh, Shotcut. And also tried Windows 10 built-in video editor. Now the audio works in there, but it's sped up. It sounds like a, like a chipmunk, right? So I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure what's going on there. But anyway, um, I emailed Acaso this morning, right? And they got back with, back with me this, this evening or this afternoon. And they, uh, they said that, uh, there was a, um, to try different audio cables. They said to try, uh, the Vinci Resolve 15. They told me to try Filmoro, but I, I you know, they, I don't have money to, to spend for that. You know, I, if I had money, I'd spent the three hundred dollars for uh, DaVinci Resolve Studio. No, I wouldn't, because it's too buggy. <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid to do that. I want DaVinci. Why is it not working in DaVinci Resolve, right? And then why is it not working right in the Windows 10 Video Editor? So, anyway, we researched and stuff. Well, I found this kind of on my own. Um, you can rip the audio right out from the the uh, video files from the Acasa, right? And you can do it a, probably a, a whole bunch of different ways, I'm sure, but you can do it in VLC, but a quick way, real quick way is doing it, doing it in DaVinci, uh, Audacity. Just drag and drop the uh, video file on there and it'll rip the audio files right, right in there. And then you can save it as MP3 and bring it back in here. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you that. And maybe somebody could, figure out what's going on, um, why it's not showing in DaVinci Resolve. Like I said, I, I'm on, well, I'm on DaVinci Resolve 17. I tried, I have 15 on an older laptop, did the same thing in there. It didn't show up in there. 
So I'm going to show you how, show you how I do it in uh, uh, re-encode the audio and bring it back in here through Audacity. I'll be right back. All right. So the file, I'm seeing what to do this file. What I'm going to do is this file. I'm just going to use that one. Drag it over here. Um, and look, there's the audio file that wouldn't play in Audacity. I mean, uh, in uh, DaVinci Resolve 17. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and save that as MP3 uh, export as a wave. And so what, what are you going to call this? Let's call this. Good enough right there, and I don't want to change that folder. Uh, let's put it back in here to do, 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 do whatever the name of the, right there. Save. I don't need any of that. All right, let's go back to uh, I'll bring into DaVinci Resolve and we shall see what happens there. We're back up here in DaVinci Resolve. I need, oops, I forgot to drag the uh, audio file. Here, let me see, I don't know if you're gonna see it. This top, I don't think it. Uh, so, I'm dragging this audio file in here that I just extracted. All right, so let's, let's look you can see there's data form in there right now so let's put it just put it under here well look i'm gonna make it a little bit louder let's play it all right we were recording Kai. come over here come here come here come here we are recording we are recording yeah we so it's a workaround it's a pain in the butt yeah um we if you attend to use your audio works. when you're using your action camera. Cheap SD card works. Yeah. And actually, you can hear me. I'm surprised you can hear me with this thing. i got to find out what <laughs> what firmware I have. So, and it's thunder now. Let's see if it picks that up. Woohoo! It works. I have to turn yeah, I'm satisfied with the video, the that's for sure. One. And I will. Right, Kai? So I'm sure if somebody sees it, they might be, yeah. uh, you might be able to figure out what's going on. I mean, this is a fix. It works. This is the Acaso. And then I can v export X. this. The Acaso. It'll be fine. V50X. Oh, something just cut off on me. Uh-oh. Now let's see what I think. All right. So that's my fix. Um, like I said, the audio was fine. I mean, yeah, I might have to up the volume a little bit. It's not a big deal if I choose to use the audio from the uh, Acaso V50X. But anyway, um, I hope that helps somebody. If you know they're going through the same thing when I'm going through, I thought since I got the most recent uh, firmware update, I might not have these problems. But it's strange. Um, I don't know. Maybe somebody else might know something why why da Vinci is not seeing it but this is a workaround and it works for me so guys thanks for tuning in we shall see you later